Hey everybody and welcome to part 4 of Super Mario Bros. 3. Let's do level 4 of World 4. So this is 4, 4, 4, and 4. Uh, no. Get this before we lose whatever it's going to be due to Lakitu throwing spinies down at us in the water. With giant coral. Also, why isn't Lakitu big or the spinies? Also, why are there no threats in the water? Don't tell me there's gonna be literally nothing the entire time, and I'm just gonna get to the pipe here in a second. Oh, like, that's the level? Game, that was a joke. 40 seconds and we're already done that. And that's with the intro and going through all the screens. Fire flower. Oh yeah, let's see. Ah, we can fight this sledge brother. How about we take on level 6 before level 5? Be a rebel. And he's dead. Oh, an invincibility star. Don't really actually care for them since invincibility only lasts a brief time in this game. Oh, we literally have to fight both of them. Fire! There's three in this world. Holy cow. And a P-Wing. Now that is an insanely good power. up We're saving that for a level in specific. Ah, yeah, there's- it's by a flower. Is it a flower level, like a piranha plant level? Oh wait, this might be Goomba's boot level. I'm not actually sure when that actually comes up. Also, why is there a door? Oh wait, that's if you want the enemies to be small, or well, I guess regular size. Don't really want that power up. I really do like the fire flower in this game. Like, it literally defeats most enemies. Like, in Super Mario World, I prefer the cape, but in this game, I don't. I honestly don't. That's just me. Oh man, I kind of want that flower. Or, no, I meant the leaf, not the flower. You're just doing that because I said the wrong thing, right? And you're tired of me killing you? No! <laughs> I seen that too late. Oh, why, man? Oops, wrong button. You know what, since we haven't used the frog suit, I'm pretty sure there's like maybe one or two water levels left in the entire game. Let's use its really bad on land abilities. Well, you know what, Feather? You're really good for this level. Maybe we can actually skip a portion. Actually, hang on. Can I get rid of him? Never mind, because he still got me anyway. God darn it, why does he always get me? Oh. Oh. I didn't realize that I kicked it. I thought I had it in my hand. You know what? Screw it. Also, nothing up there. Ah, you're tiny now. Like, even the pipes are tiny, which actually honestly makes pla- oh, Seriously. I was gonna say it makes platforming harder, but... Guys, this is not that hard of a level, too. That is the thing. I'm just being really bad at this. What? What the heck, man? Should I also probably message my girlfriend after this recording? Like, I don't think I've messaged her and... Why did I come here, Tiny? Tiny Tiger, brought to you in part by Nostalgia Scott's other LPs that are currently going on on his channel. Like an annoying run of relics in... Crash Bandicoot the Huge Adventuro! Oh god. I honestly thought I was gonna get hit there. I should have, but I didn't, so. Okay, let's do it when everything's tiny. I forgot green ones walk off ledges, red ones don't. Red ones are smart. I oh, meant just missed out on that. Alright. Okay. You know what, dude? Darn it. Can you like actually can you come with me? Wait. Dude, seriously? Ah, oh, failure. That was so bad. Mushroom house. Also, the card game's over there, but I'm not going all the way back there for that. Fire flower. Don't mind if I do. Level five. Is it giant, or is this the Goomba? No. I don't think Goomba's boot. I knew there were. Darn it, I was hoping he would jump higher than that. Um, he clipped through the block. I should have been safe on that darn block. Also, I have a notification on my phone. No, stop opening up. Oh, it's just my own upload of Super... Why 
Why didn't it up tell me when I uploaded the other one? Fireflower. Fireflower seems so OP in this game. And we're gonna, like, I've died a lot on these last few levels. And we're literally only five minutes into the video. Are you gonna spawn back already? Darn it. Darn it, there's like no getting past that guy. Oh, he was actually going to hop up there. Um, can I like get that without? Oh yeah, actually I don't really care because you don't get a backup mushroom anyway you automatically stay big. Super Mario World also has it more difficult on the power-ups, but the game itself, I think, feels easier. Okay, you know what? I'm actually going to show you guys what the P-Wing does. Not because it's a difficult level, but just because I thought, why not show it off anyway? Because it looks like there's st stuff above this level due to the clouds. The P-Wing is literally the Tanuki tail with an actual like, infinite flying boost. So I need four coins to get a life. Oh, there was a secret up here. Wait, is this what I think it is? <gasps> it's the actual Tanuki suit. Oh, yeah. Now we can come down here with infinite flying Tanuki suit and extra coins. Don't mind if I do. Wait, isn't that where I died? Oh, I kept thinking, like, the timer meant I was gonna stop flying. I'm like, wait, that's not what that does. And we got ourselves a star. Now we gotta go to the fortress. I believe if you push down B, yeah, you turn into an invincible statue that enemies can't hurt. So it allows you to, like, hide while enemies walk by. We do not need another power-up because unless it's a fire flower in there. Oh, man. Man. man, actually having the, the Tanuki suit here is really good. See, when I got mad at myself for saying Tanuki suit, this is what I meant by I was mad because there actually is a Tanuki suit. Also, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a door there. Or maybe it's, it was just coins to look like it was... Actually, it was just coins to look like a door. It wasn't actually a door at all. These B-switches don't show doors in this, I believe. No, we lost it already! Darn it! Easy fortress, though. And that just opens up the bridge. Hey, the game showed up here. Yay! Oh, and I didn't realize there was a roulette there. Seriously, man. Why do I keep failing that? Like, seriously, that is the mushroom. Like, I knew that was the mushroom as well. That was the thing. Okay. Okay, we got it. What's the last one? Star? Yeah, star. There we go, we did it! Ah, screw the roulette. Oh, the game's still over there. Maybe it just stays in certain locations. He turned into Donkey Kong. You look bad, Donkey Kong. You really honestly do. I'm just gonna start speeding up certain parts for you guys. Oh god, this is a really slow moving ship. Why? Is that just a bullet bill launcher? No, it's a flame launcher. You know, maybe the ship would go faster if it actually just kept the flames going. Like, I don't even know what kind of challenge this is. I really feel like this is like the slow-mo challenge. How slow can you beat a level lag? I have such an itchy nose lately while recording. It's not even funny. Like, it, it, not the inside of my nose, but the outside. It gets so itchy. Then as soon as I stop recording, it's back to normal. Also, there's a random pit down there. Also, what way is that flame going? So we got the wrench dude up there. Yay, wrench dude. Oh, God. Oh. Ow, my butt is on fire. Oh. Mario, you almost uh, burned your wiener off there. Also, that's probably a power-up. Yes. Just what the doctor ordered, Mario. Because you know you were also Dr. Mario secretly. You know, that's like his secret identity. No one will know that... This Mario is actually Dr. Mario. How dumb that sounds. But his name is clearly Mario, and it's like, yeah, that's the joke. His name is Mario. This takes so long. I don't want to fail in this boss. I really don't. We're running low on time on this, uh, 
level too. Like they barely give you enough time. Oh, and now we're gonna fail the boss. Unless, like the previous level, they have a power up after. Oh, thank God they do. Oh, literally, it, oh, I'm like, it doesn't stop? That's scary. Iggy, is that you or are you Larry? Also, why are you not doing anything? Why didn't he do anything? Was he supposed to do something or was he supposed to be like, since my ship is so slow and boring, I'm not going to do anything. Oh, oh. Oh, splendid, splendid. I am back to myself again. Thank you so much. Here's a letter from that princess. God, that one actually hurt the face. Greetings. The thief who stole the whistle has escaped to the east side of the sand dunes. I have enclosed a jewel that helps protect you. Yes, the thief. Yay, world four perfect clear in 11 minutes with lots of fails. So that's, that's actually pretty good. Oh, the longest world in the game. The ground to sky world. Oh, these guys who throw blocks. Sweet. And chain chomps. Triumphant return with random water. And I feel like the oh, these these uh munchers. I don't actually know what they are. No one actually knows their name. The muncher like enemy that isn't oh. Pretty sure that's the Goomba that also like spits up little Goombas. Easy first level. Pretty sure the first level of every world is easy though. Level two. Don't think there's gonna be any water levels here. Oh, this is a cave level all along. You tricked me. Oh no, it's actually a pipe level. But I didn't think we were in the pipe world yet. Oh man. Ah! Let's go up. I believe that is that the shortcut. Can't remember if that's the shortcut or the way you're supposed to go. Yeah, either way, I think we're done the level. So that was really weird. I couldn't get up there for some reason. Yay! Five lives. We're on thirty now. Ah, game and mushroom house. I'm good. I'm glad to know that game doesn't disappear. <gasps> Tanuki suit. There's so many power-ups in this game. Mini game. All right, mushroom, mushroom. Wow, talk about lucky. Mushroom, one up. Okay. Twenty coins. Ten coins. Boo! You suck, Mario. I'm pretty sure this just leads us to the other side of the island. Let's do the fortress. Because there is no indication that it comes before level 3. Or after level 3. Also, thwomps and atomic waffles. Also, I almost ran into that. I believe there's a hidden power up there with thwomp, though. Also, booze. That was actually scary. Oh. Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do here. Oh, thank God it didn't fail me. Oh, my glasses popped out, so I'm going to have to fix them after this video. I knew something was up. And just a random open room with boom. Bam, bam. That was like my worst showing ever with that, but we did it. And we built a bridge and got ourselves a save point. Either way, I have to take on one of them before the level. Also, there's a random tower level. Oh man, my poor power up. Is there a power up in here by chance? Come on. You gotta give me a darn power up, man. I don't think I'm gonna get that block up there. And watch, there's gonna be no power ups. Nope. And all that for a darn invincibility star. This level might actually have water since it's next to a river. Or it might be a- Oh no, I think this is the Goomba's boot level. Yes it is. You go in the opposite direction also. I know there's a power up in there. You wouldn't just put an enemy down here and give me a random coin. There, so all you have to do is 
wait for him to actually get close enough. Darn it. Oh, man, I want to ride the boot. Actually, I think you might have to get him under a block. Yeah, there you go. Now I can just kill enemies with this. It's a super high jump, and it kills, I believe, all enemies. Also, you can walk on munchers. And even piranha plants, but I ran into that piranha plant, so it kind of backfired. Also, there's a random Goomba's boot in there. Also, that didn't work. Also, that did. Oh, that was close. I was honestly going to get hit by that. Pretty sure all we're trying to do is get to the opposite side. Like, the same side that we started on. This is weird, because, like, it's literally just an upper... Or, oh, maybe not. There was actually a pipe. Cool. Yeah, I guess we should do these other two before we take the tower. Man, why does he always do that to me? And a P-Wing! Really good! Yeah, you know, screw it. We're not doing the roulette. Don't want to do the roulette. I believe this is Block Tower? I don't know if there's any enemies. So far, Atomic Waffles and just blocks. Oh, no, never mind. There's Swamp. Technically, this is like a second fortress, I guess, for this world already. Or I guess, like, the desert had, like, a pyramid and stuff, too, so... I guess it could be like that. Yeah. Made it! Oh, this is the part that I was thinking of. Yes. I be believe there's some secrets around here somewhere. What is with that one layer of blocks that it like I don't know. Is this the one where I'm supposed to fly? It might actually be the one where I'm supposed to technically fly. Ouch. Maybe, I don't know. Or it might just end in boom boom. It actually no, I think I was thinking of a different level later on in the game. Yeah, I'm gonna have to end the episode after this guys, I apologize. I believe this is literally the end anyway. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And the next episode, we'll be starring Sky World. Bye-bye.